Welcome to Al May. We are here to share tech knowledge with you. Let's get our journey started. Today, we will teach you how to backup the virtual machine. Here we go. Part one: Why make virtual machine backup? Part two: Two ways to backup virtual machine. Virtual machines are widely used in workplace. As the number of server virtualization grows, backing up and protecting virtual machines has become an increasingly important issue. After watching this video, you will know how to make a backup of it. Some people treat VM snapshot as a backup, just like the system restore point in Windows. In fact, this is not the case. VM snapshots work in a chain. If any of the disk in the chain is damaged, the whole chain becomes damaged. Besides, VM snapshots have some disadvantages, like you cannot go back to the current state of your machine, and you cannot simply restore individual files, and so on. In this case, what you need is a backup of the VM to prevent any accidents happen. And to ensure that the VM is always available, therefore, VM backup is imperative. Here we introduce you two ways to help with VM backup. Let's take a look. Alme Backupper is a professional backup tool. With it, you can backup your VM easily to physical computer, via network, and other external hard drives such as USB flash drive. HDD or SSD. Just Google Alme Backupper, download and install it. Before we start your backup, you have to notice that don't backup your VM while running or suspended. Otherwise, your data in that state may not be restored properly. Besides, VMs take up too much resource, so you can delete backup files periodically. The first way is to backup the VM as a physical machine, which means we backup the disk where we store it. Run Alme Backupper to get its homepage. Click Backup on the left. Then click Disk Backup. Click Add Disk to select the disk you want to backup. Click to select a destination. To save the backup image, here you can backup to internal or external disk. A network location. We can click Schedule to set automatic backup per day, week, or month. Also, we can click Options and click Enable Encryption for backups. To prevent unwanted access, then run the backup task by clicking Start Backup. The second way is to backup VM as a file in a real computer, which contains many VMDK files. These VMDK files can be backed up quickly, so it is easier for us. Click File Backup under the Backup tab. Click Add Folder. To select the folder contains all items of your virtual machine. Select a destination path for your VM files. Set Schedule Backup and click Start Backup. That's everything related to backing up virtual machine. With the help of Alme Backupper, you can backup VM in simple steps. How this video can be such a help for you. Want to know more about Alme? Looking for more tech knowledge? Just subscribe us and leave comments. We are here to help you with any questions.